Hey guys, I am Rajat and today in this video, I am going to show you how you can install HROM A7 port version 5 in your Samsung Exynos 7870 devices. To install the ROM, all you need to do is turn off your device and boot it to your custom recovery mode by pressing the home button, power key and the volume up key at the same time. For the installation of the HROM, I would like to recommend you to use the Orange Fox Recovery. Now if you don't know how to install Orange Fox Recovery, check the video that is popping up now in the right corner. Now make sure that you have downloaded these zip files. First one is the create vendor zip file because the ROM is travel tenable. Second one is the repartitioner zip file which helps you to increase your system size. Third one is the HROM A7 port zip file and fourth one is the Napper motor. All the links of the zip files has given in the description box. Now after opening your custom recovery mode, you have to wipe your device. For that, just go to the third section and select here the Delvic Art Cache, Cache System and Data and swipe the arrow to the right side for wiping. Now just go back. To install the ROM, first of all flash the create vendor zip file. Now once you have installed the create vendor zip file, reboot your recovery mode. Now the ROM requires 4GB of system size, for that you have to flash the repartition as zip file. And after flashing the repartition as zip files, everything will be erased from your internal storage. So make sure that you have kept a backup of your internal storage. After flashing the repartition as zip file, your recovery mode will be automatically rebooted. As you can see that everything has been erased from my internal storage after flashing the repartition as the file. Now do a complete format of your device. For that just go to the third section and then select format data, type here yes and tap on the tick button. Since everything has been erased, I am going to copy the two last zip files from my PC to my device by using a USB cable. Now just flash the zip file of the HROM A7 port. The installation of the HROM's zip file will take a large amount of time, so be patient. As you can see that the HROM has been successfully installed. Now if you want to customize your navigation bar, just go back and flash the navbar model. By that you can enable or disable your navigation gestures and bar. I am going to show you how you can customize your navbar in a fast forward mode. And after the modification of the navigation bar, the device will be automatically booted.
Now if your device is stuck at the boot logo, don't worry. Do a power reboot by pressing the volume down key and the power key simultaneously. By that your device will be booted. This video is just an installation video. If you want to know the features and bugs, check the description box. And still have any query that is not listed in the description box, let me know in the comments. And it is based on One UI 2 with Android 10 version. So that's it for today. Please subscribe to this channel and guys I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.